Sup YouTube update on the uh, 20 gallon high is my cichlid. Sometimes she, her colors get a little strange, but I don't know. But yeah. Um, for some reason I've been having a strange melting problem in this tank. Usually it's all green, but all of a sudden these um, ferns started to melt like crazy. I even got one in the back. Now it's starting to melt away too. And the uh, Amazon sword, that one, it's not that bad. I only have that one leaf in this. This leaf is melting, but I, I don't know what's the matter. Uh, my leaves are melting away, it seems like, on these plants. So that one, I guess it's okay. It's got those two leaves with a little bit on it, but this one is really melting. I don't know why. I don't think anything's wrong with my water. I don't test it or anything. See how bad that looks? I'm hoping that it doesn't die. There's still a lot of green on it, so I'm not really too worried, but I don't know. I'm hoping it doesn't die, because look, it's all the way down there, and there's still some brown there. I don't know. Can someone tell me why it's melting? Is it is it too hot in here? I, it's at 76 right now, and here's my shark. He swims around. He's got a little bit of fin route on his, on his uh, shark fin. I think he does. I don't think it's snipping. You can see it right there. I'm trying to get a good shot of it. You can't zoom in on an iPod touch. That's what I use to videotape, but my fish are doing good. There's my little cichlid. I don't think she's gonna grow too much more. Which is fine with me. Man, I really wanna upgrade the I haven't gotten a chance to yet, but... Oh, there's my Pleco. It does nothing. The algae in the tank has actually started to decrease. As you can see on these plants, the um, blackbeard algae, it's starting to thin out. So, that's a good sign, but these are really what's my problems. I like the way my tank looks with those plants in the corners. And I want to thicken up the back, so I put one in there. It's my cichlid. So yeah. My shark kind of does that a lot. Sometimes he swims around, sometimes he's lazy. I might take him back. Not sure yet, but... Yeah. I'm thinking about turning the goldfish tank into maybe a saltwater tank. This tank, the algae bloom. It's pretty much gone. I like my goldfish, but I mean, I've never had salt water, so. It'd be cool to just have like, maybe a uh, sea anemone. I'm gonna get a new filter definitely for a salt water tank. This filter's terrible, as you can see, but it'd be cool to have like maybe some fake coral and maybe like a sea anemone and maybe one, uh, one um, clownfish would be cool. And I know you have to start off the tank first with uh, like crustaceans to help with the bio material and stuff like that. So I like my goldfish, but I've never had saltwater fish before. So and what I'd probably end up doing with these guys is let them go in a creek, which is something I don't really want to do. That is, I would like to keep them, but I do want saltwater. So who knows? They're really, really healthy. So.